Hey guys, so I just got done climbing the uh, Great Sand Dunes of Colorado, Sand Dune National Park, and it was pretty tough. Hana, you want to say hi? Say hi. <laughs> Hana, uh, Hana and I climbed it together, which means I was holding her 99% of the way. But that's besides the point. The topic that I want us to focus on is climbing your mountain. And everybody has different mountains. We all have different challenges that we need to overcome or that we want to take on. And what's important is finding that challenge, looking at that mountain or that hill or however, however you want to describe it, and taking a step walking, going step by step, uh, even if it means you encounter some resistance or it gets tough, you find a way to take a step every day, you take a step, a little step, every hour to get closer to that goal. And what's more important is, once you, what's, uh, what's interesting is once you get up to a certain mountain, once you get up to your mountain, that challenge of your mountain of challenge what you're gonna find is there's plenty of mountains uh, that are tire taller that are higher holy smokes I just saw a guy slide down the hill like 40 feet anyways and yeah I guess you might even find yourself challenged and you end up sliding downhill uh, and going backwards in pursuit of that challenge but again what's important is that you remain steadfast you know what your goals are and you got to know that you're going to get there. It's just a matter of taking a step towards that goal each and every day, each and every opportunity that you get. Um, I, we had the opportunity, our whole family, to climb the sand dunes this time. This was my third time. First time I went on my own. Second time with, with Ty. And the third time with, with my wife, Jenny, and our daughter, Hannah. But... Uh, bring the you know don't let so i think a lot of people kind of saw us and they said like you guys are crazy um some people said good job but uh you know for many people it would have been an excuse not to climb but for us it was a it was a good reason it was a reason to take on a challenge and i'm glad that we have a family that's willing to take on a challenge not make excuses regardless of what's what might be difficult so again going back to the point uh, taking on your challenge uh, find your challenge get to that hill get to the top once you get to that top you're gonna find that there's more to the challenge there's other hills that you can take on and you might be happy with being where you are but know that if you want to continue there's more challenges to take on but there's no way you can continue to take on those those deeper or higher challenges without getting to your first point of destination right your first goal so make your first goal whatever however tall or however small or whatever it may be go find a goal find a challenge and take it on head first one step at a time and I look forward to uh, seeing how I can help you guys with that um, give me a call send me an email let me know what I can do to uh, motivate you guys to help you guys get through that that challenge. Talk to you guys soon. So yeah, find your goals, set them, get to them, and then realize those are stepping stones to get to the next spot. If you want to be a state champion, then you should look to be a regional champion. If you want to be a regional champion, look to be a league champion. If you want to be a world champion, you should probably be a national champion. Just like that. So you're reverse, you're thinking in reverse and you're setting your goals so that you can get a little bit closer
so that you can climb that hill, overcome your first challenge, your first obstacle, and get to that next one. I'll see you guys on the mat.